take some moments to find your body, aware that there is a body. Maybe bring to mind now what you might think of as an embodied mindfulness. And you bring the mindfulness not just from the mind, but from the body as well. How do you know when mindfulness is present? Perhaps we can develop more familiarity with what helps us to be mindful more often. So right now, see if you can establish mindfulness of the body so that you are fully present in the here and now. starting at the very top of the head. Notice that area. Notice the scalp, the skin. The skin on the face. And the back of the head. Noticing the flesh in the face, in the cheeks. The space between the ears. The tongue. Noticing the bones, the skull, the cheekbones, the hardness of the teeth, the jaw, the jawbone. No right or wrong, a simple noticing of body parts. Moving down the body, maybe noticing the neck now, the front and back of the neck the skin, and what's inside the skin. No better or worse. muscles and tendons of the neck. It helped to hold the head up. The 
top of the spine. So that we begin to notice the body from the inside, not the outside. Moving down again, one shoulder, right or left, pick one, doesn't matter which. The skin that covers that shoulder. The flesh and bones inside the shoulder. upper arm, the skin, the muscles, tendons inside the upper arm, the arm bone, the elbow bone, These bodies are made up of skin, flesh, and bones. They are of the nature to change. The lower arm. and the hand. The skin on the hand. The nails. Feeling the inside of the fingers. may be aware of the little tingling in the fingers or the hands. That's produced by the blood that's moving through the body. The small bones in the hand Coming now to the other shoulder. The skin that covers the shoulder, that covers the flesh and covers the bones. present with the body. The upper arm. Inside the upper arm. The elbow. We all have felt the bony nature of the elbow.
the lower arm, the flesh around the bones, tendons, moving down into the hand, top of the hand, the bottom of the hand, refining our awareness of this body. Perhaps you're noticing how the body has changed over the years. That is the nature of the body. It's not about you. Moving now to the upper body, the upper front of the body. Noticing the skin. the flesh, the organs inside, muscles, tendons, the back of the upper body, can we notice the back? of the upper body, something we often are not aware of. Feeling that there's skin there. There are fleshy parts. And the bones of the rib cage, protecting the organs, the roundness of the rib cage. Moving down now to the lower part of the body. The pelvis. the front and back of the pelvis, the skin covering the belly, the buttocks, the genitals, the flesh, and the bones. Not paying attention to what this body looks like on the outside, feeling it, knowing it from the inside. the pelvic bone, moving down the legs now, both legs, the skin that covers the legs. the upper legs and the lower legs.
feeling the legs from the inside, the flesh. Muscles, tendons, the bones of the legs, the upper bone, the thigh bone, the knees. the lower legs. Moving down to the feet, pick one foot, doesn't matter right or left. Noticing the flesh covering that one foot, the top of the foot, the bottom of the foot, the toes, aware of the inside of that foot. aware of the bones inside the foot. Aware of the other foot. Skin, flesh, bones. The toenails. Taking a few moments now to feel the whole body or if some part of the body is calling your attention, notice that. If you like feeling the body from the inside, the breath, how the breath moves, the skin, the flesh, and the bones. Maybe enjoying the breath. Perhaps the body and mind feels more integrated now. Whole, whole body awareness.
If you're not doing it already, feel free to settle into mindfulness of breathing. And if you'd like to bring the palms together in front of the chest, if it's in your practice to bow. Taking a few moments now, however you like to, to honor your efforts. To honor your efforts to be more wakeful, more mindful for embodied mindfulness. Perhaps you experienced less attachment to the outer body, knowing the body more from the inside. These bodies are of the nature to age, to become sick. Body parts don't keep working the same ways that they used to. Bodies need more attention as we age. And it is of the nature of these bodies to pass away. Perhaps taking a few moments to have some compassion and loving kindness toward the body how it served you. That the body is of the nature to change. Caring for yourself and others who may be experiencing body pain or sickness. challenges of aging.
And now to lighten the mood a bit, I have a short quote from Rory Chapman. She writes, I like nothing more in the world than sitting on my ass doing nothing. And it's not my fault I have this attitude because I happen to have an amazingly comfortable ass. It may not look like much, but if you could sit on this baby for two minutes, you'd realize that getting off this ass would be a crime against nature.